Hey guys, it's Ashley, and I haven't been posting a lot in a while. I only have one video up, and that's with my friend, and that video was really embarrassing, so I'm going to take that off of my page, and yeah. So, I'm going to teach you how to do a really natural look if you have braces, so people will be focusing more on your eyes, and this is not the natural look right now. This is just a thing I just put on right now, because I'm going out in a couple of minutes. So yeah. So this is what I have on right now, but this is definitely not what I'm going to teach you how to do. Oh my god, I need to get my eyebrows done so bad. Okay, so, yeah. So, sorry that I'm trying to make them like this, oh my god. Okay, so now I'm going to teach you how to do this eye makeup and... No, not this eye makeup, a natural look, so people won't be focusing so much on your teeth. So, yeah, let's get started. Okay, so I just took off all my makeup, and this is my bare face. I'm sorry that you have to see this. So now I'm just going to go ahead and grab my favorite concealer. It's a Garnier Skin Renew Anti-Dark Circle Roller. So this is what it looks like. And I don't really know what color it's in. But yeah, <laughs> so it comes like that, and it's like a roll. So yeah. So I'm just going to apply this to my dark circles. And you just want to apply a little bit and just blend it out with your ring finger. Um, so I'm just going to take this finger oops, and just blend and blend until it looks really natural and just good. Okay, so you just want to blend that out and cover up any other blemishes with the same concealer. It doesn't really matter what kind of concealer you have, just get a good coverage concealer. So now I'm just going to grab my powder and just powder up where I put the concealer on and on my cheeks just to give a little coverage to the blemishes that I have. So you just want to cover up your face. Not all of it, but just where you have the blemishes and all stuff like that. Okay, so the next thing that you want to grab is any kind of primer. Um, I forgot to tell you guys this, that I made another video about this, but I deleted it because it was really embarrassing as well. But this is a look for more natural and more, like, if you can't wear that much makeup or your mom doesn't allow you to wear that much makeup, then you can just use this and then you have a nice face presentable for school. But you just need the coverage so no one will be looking at that. It's kind of more embarrassing if people look at your pimples than at your mouth. So yeah. So I'm just going to grab my Wet n Wild by Fergie. So it looks like this. And grab my Eco Tools flat brush for concealer. I use it for primer. And I grabbed a little too much. But oh, that's okay. I'll just grab from the edge. Okay. So now I'm just going to apply it all over my lid and be right back. Okay, so now that I applied this all over my lid, it's not really a color, it's just a really nice nude color. Sorry, I'm a little sniffly, um, I have a cold. Um, so now I'm just gonna grab this palette, it's from e.l.f., it's called Sugar Kiss. So I'm gonna grab this sparkly color right here, and just apply that onto my lid. So I'm just gonna grab it with my finger. And just apply this onto my lid. So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so this is what I did for the eye. So I just put a gold and then I put it in my inner corner. So next you want to take the e.l.f. Professional Blending Eye Brush. It's like this. And then I'm going to take this one. And I'm, you're going to take any brown from here and focus it and let's just, and then just grab that. Um, I'm just going to swirl it around in there and then grab the more sun-kissed one and just work that into your crease. So just as little as possible to just have a little bit of um like a little contour and to just make your eyes a little wider so like that 
see a difference? Even just a little bit can go a long way. Because it does open up your eyes a lot. So yeah, I just want to do it to this other eye as well. Okay, so I've curled both my lashes. And after that, you want to just grab a good mascara that will make your lashes really long. And you just want to apply a couple coats. Okay, so you just want to apply a couple coats onto your lashes to make them big and long and luminous and perfect. Because people mostly want to, um, where it's like you mostly want people to look at your eyes than at your mouth. So, yeah. Okay, so now I just applied a couple layers of mascara and on the top and bottom lashes. So then after that, you want to grab your favorite blusher. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, here it is. Mine's kind of broken. As you can see, <laughs> it's like totally broken, but I still have some product left. So I have to go to the store. It just broke today, and it all dumped down on the ground, and I'm not going to pick it up again. So later on, I'm going to go to the store and buy some. So now you're just going to smile. Or go like that. And... You'll find your apples or your cheeks. Like that. Okay. So I think I'll do that. And I'm just gonna blend. that I'm gonna grab a nice nude and just apply that onto my brow bone so there and just blend that in now I'm gonna apply just a little bit of black eyeliner from my bottom lash line. Lash line? Lash line? Water line. Water line. It's a lash line. Oh, it is a lash line. If I can even find it, I like sit face. This is so so oh, okay. So now I'm just gonna grab this. Don't do this. It makes you look. It looks good, but. I'm just gonna blend it so it won't look as harsh. It's not like that. I don't wanna poke my eye. Okay, sorry I'm not talking, but I'm going to do the same thing to this. I'll be right back. Okay, so this is the makeup, and now you just want to comb your brows a little bit and just make them really defined. So now, okay, I'm going to wear your tissue. Okay, so I made a little bit of um, lip balm in this little container so it's just a really nice color and yeah so you can literally make any kind of lip balm with a little bit of petroleum drilly or Vaseline and um, a crushed up eyeshadow and it just is so pigmented like And you just want to have like a color that's really close to your lips, but not really. So this color is pretty good. But you don't want to have like a super red color. So yeah. 
So wait one second. Um, I'm just gonna apply a little bit of hairspray to the ends of my hair. Okay. Okay, so thank you guys. I hope you enjoyed um, my video. Just this hair, this you can bring to school. It's really nice, and you can just take it to school. You can do whatever you want. It's really good. I said it like three times already. Um, but yeah, see you later. Bye, guys. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, and like this video because that really helps me out, and that makes me know that you guys want to see more of my videos. So yeah, bye, guys. Sorry.